In today's world, agriculture and horticulture faces increasing pressure to produce high quality crops efficiently and sustainably all year round. Growers need to stay competitive, especially in the UK market, where food resilience and resource use optimization are crucial. The key challenge in the industry is uh, shortage of labor, high energy costs, pest control, resource optimization, and in particular, light improvement. Yet, testing innovative products and approaches can be risky for small scale business. They don't have the time or resources to experiment, and they need products that are scientifically tested and proven. For example, the optimization of crop light environment and greenhouse in the UK is still a big challenge. At the same time, Glass and lighting manufacturers often lack the facilities and expertise to test their products under real-world horticultural conditions. Well, a small improvement in lights can help us to increase yield and overcome some challenge related to pest control. Enter the Greenhouse Innovation Consortium, or GIC. This groundbreaking initiative brings together the glass, lighting and horticultural industries to develop and test new technologies that will shape the future of food in the UK. The ultimate aim of the Greeners Innovation Consortium is to identify and then overcome challenges within the production system across the UK and therefore help farmers in particular, growers and greenhouses, to optimise their production, reduce costs for their production and increase yield and quality. I've brought together the Greenhouse Innovation Consortium, which is composed of a number of companies across the northwest of England, as well as international companies, and also includes higher education institutions like ourselves, like Edge University. So, so far we've been working very closely with Edge Hill to develop some prototype greenhouses. So this has been testing on a, a small scale, but allowing us to look at a range of, or a number of different types of our glass products and see how plants actually grow over a season. Going forward, we're looking to expand this further, hopefully expanding the growing season as well as uh, increasing the number of greenhouses. By collaborating, these experts can optimise light conditions in glass houses, improve energy efficiency, share their expertise and tackle industry challenges. We're hoping to use these initial results in order to be able to scale up to a more commercial scale. This will be done in collaboration with our GIC partners bringing in other elements, not just the glass side. The benefits are clear. Better plant growth and higher yields, more energy efficient solutions and a collaborative approach to sustainability. Through the GIC, we're not only creating new opportunities for Lancashire and the North West, but to lead the way in innovative plant research and greenhouse product development. We're also bolstering the UK's food resilience. The consortium opens doors to new funding streams, connects companies nationally and internationally and helps develop sustainability solutions to tackle global food security. The GIC is contributing to a more sustainable future for everyone.